my career in racing, there has certainly been no more colourful character than Peter Casey. A remarkable man. If you were doing previews for a handicap chase for horses rated less than 100 and you needed to ring him up for a quick quote, you might have been in a real rush and you just wanted a quote on the horse. A half an hour later and you were debating the Irish government or the Dublin football team or anything that was in the news at the time. He was the most remarkable man you could ever meet. People will remember him for that. Astonishing interview with Tracy Piggott on RTE and uh, no matter what humour you are in that day, you could have been down on the dumps. If you just watched that interview, it certainly would have cheered you up. And that's what Peter Casey did. He put smiles on faces. But not only did he put smiles on faces, he was also a very, very good trainer. And his handling of Fleming Star was flawless. In that novice chasing season, he won three grade ones. And obviously his performance in the Irish Arkle was fantastic. But his Power Gold Cup performance at Fairy House after sidestepping Cheltenham in favour of Fairy House was probably his best ever display. We all remember that performance in the Lexus when he was caught close home by Tidal Bay. What a race that was. He probably didn't stay three miles, but we got to see the best of him in his novice chasing season. And he was a star. Peter Casey was also a star. He's going to be sadly missed. Unfortunately, in the last couple of years, he probably didn't have the horses to bring him to big headlines like Fleming Star did. But he will be remembered fondly from the Irish racing public and the public everywhere in the world because he was a man that we will never forget. And may he rest in peace.